Hello everyone, this is Dale Cantrell of the Marieville Homeless Church. Uh, to, I want to make you a Start Your Day Off Right series video for Monday, August 23rd. Uh, my quote is, your life is shaped by the doors you walk through and those you walk past. My story, are you a help today or are you one that hinders? You will either do one or the other to your church, family, and friends. I hear people say all the time, I'm not a help, but I'm not a hindrance. Oh, yes, you are. If you're not a help, then you're a hindrance. You cannot ride the fence. You will either fall off on one side or the other. You will fall to the help side or the side that hinders. I made a statement once that I wanted to walk, leave the walks of this life the day I started hindering. As soon as I could, I told him I wanted to make a correction to that statement. I told him I did not want to leave the day I started hindering, but instead I wanted to leave the day before. There are too many things a person can do to help others that there should be no reason to ever think about hindering someone else. My scripture is James 1, 6 through 8. But let him ask in faith nothing wavering, for he that wavers like the wave of sea, driven with the wind and tossed, for let that man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Um, my humor, a couple were dining out celebrating their 40th anniversary after the meal the husband presented his wife romantically with a very beautiful and very old gold antique locket on a chain. Uh, amazingly, when his wife opened the locket, a tiny fairy appeared. Um, addressing the astonished couple, the fairy said, Your 40 years of devotion to each other has released me from this locket, and in turn I can now grant you both one wish each, anything that you want. Without hesitating, the wife said, Please, can I travel to the four corners of the, er, of the world with my husband, as happy and in love as we've always been? The what, fairy waved her hand with a flourish, and magically there on the table were two first-class tickets for a round-the-world holiday. Staggered, the couple looked at each other, unable to believe their love. Your turn, said the fairy and the wife to the husband. The husband thought for a few seconds and then said with a little guilt in his voice, Forgive me. But to really enjoy that holiday of a lifetime, I yearn for a younger woman, so that I wish my wife could be 30 years younger than me. Shocked, the fairy glanced at the wife without, and with a knowing look in her eye, waved her hand, and the husband became 93. I hope this has uh, helped you today. And until we do this again, this is Dale Cantrell of the Marineville Holders Church. My number is 256 May God bless you.